if you have a WooCommerce store, you know it's not enough just to have a product image because you cannot show off your product completely. You can't even show the functionalities completely. But WooCommerce only has a feature to add a product image. So today I'm going to show you how to add product videos in the WooCommerce store. First of all, you need to make sure that you have the Wow Store plugin installed and activated on your site. Now from your dashboard, scroll down till you see the product video feature and enable it if you want you can even customize some of the features like you can decide whether you want to show the video product video on shop and archive pages or show it only on single product page you can enable or disable them anytime that you want you can even decide if you want the play icon on featured image you can set it on direct video embedded or icon on images. Furthermore, you can even select the type of icon that you want. Once you're done with this setting, click on save settings. Now let's see how we can add videos to a product. We'll go to the product from our dashboard, then click on the product that you want to add a video to. Now in the individual product setting, you can see that the wow store settings have been added right over here. You can insert a link of a video if you want to display the video from a link. It can be a YouTube link or a Vimeo link. You can even insert a link for an image. To upload your own video, select media library and click on this icon right over here. Go to upload files and select the file from your local drive or wherever you have the video. I've already uploaded one, so I'm just going to select it. Then I'm going to click on add new video. Similarly, you can upload the image. I have already uploaded it, so I'm just going to select this one. And that's about it. Now you can even decide if you want the video to autoplay video to repeat itself or just play on hover i'm just gonna click select uh, video repeat once we are done we will just click on the update button now with that done let's go back to our store refresh the page and see how it looks so these are our product without any video product video and these are our product with product videos. So let's just click on the video and see it just works. Let's go to the single product page. Here's our product, product image and here's our product video. Since I haven't kept it on autoplay, I have to click it. And that was so simple and easy to implement. Thanks to Wowstro. So that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. If you have any more questions or suggestions, feel free to drop them in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe.